Hello and welcome back, I'm Beeble Joe, and this is Transport Fever 2 Deluxe Console and All That Good Stuff Edition. We are here today building a bigger passenger network, hopefully high speed, hopefully through the end of the map and connect, well, most of things. Before I get to do all the fun things, there's something that's a little weird here. This guy thinks there's no free path in front of it. Um, what's going on here? There is really not much happening here. There's a there's a single arrow going that way. Okay, you could get through there. Okay, and there's nobody in front of you. Oh, there's somebody in front of you. How did you end up on here, buddy? <laughs> Interesting. Very, very interesting. You should not even be on that thing. Yes, you. I, I could have you turn around, but that's... How did you... What happened here? You are on the wrong track. Uh, a friend of mine actually managed to do that, not... Like, just in the beginning, um, when, when he was trying to set up some Transport Fever 2 stuff, and I have no idea how it came to that. So, let's make this a one-way signal. And hope that they can figure it out from there, because yeah, that was that was a little wrong, <laughs> a little very very wrong. And there we go, the the other train actually went in there, which is what we wanted. I am hoping to see some electric trains today, very much hoping so. Um, but we'll see. I don't I don't know if we have what's this train. This I think this is a good sign because this is the train. Oh, are you too long now? Is that your problem? Are you too long? Just slightly, just. Just a smidge, just a smidge. Let's let's fix fix that um, as much as we can fix this. Give me some track. Give me some keep. Give me some this. You don't like that? Okay, too much curvature or whatever is going on. That's fine. Give me a little bit of that. Give me a little bit of this then. Uh, yes, you don't have to go high speed. That is fine. Remove that signal. Give me a signal back, and then everything should work. Uh, no path. Turn around. Turn around, buddy. There you go. Now, now get out of here. I guess that must have happened when I upgraded them, and that is not ideal, but it's fine. Should be working now, so that is the main piece of stuff that we should care about. Cool. Wonderful. Now, how do I want to set this up? This scrumptious is definitely our, our larger city, and I guess Irkby is also getting really close to it. Um, Scrumptious, Middleton, Greater Wellington, Bournemouth definitely is not anything that we care about. I guess Scrumptious is going to be my center here, and that's what we're going to connect via high-speed rail, which will hopefully be a bullet train eventually. I'm thinking Swanley gets a station, then we go through Winsford, that's not going to get a high-speed station, but just a station, and then probably... Either Eastley or Stuttfold. Stuttfold. I haven't fully decided that yet. And which one do I want? Well, the thing is... Oh, Halesworth is actually a lot bigger. This Halesworth yeah, it seems like a good hub, hub city. Just location and termination and all that stuff. And then we can still connect everything else after, after we get done with everything. Oddbury, yes. I, I, I kind of like this. Winsford, Swanley, and Oddbury could have... Uh, and the, no, there there are a lot of good jobs. <laughs> I'm getting excited for no real reason. Uh, what am I excited about? I don't know. Oddbury and Swanley both seem like they need some good connection. It could be a quick. That could be even a tram. This could be a tram. Oddbury and Swanley could be a tram connection for like a light rail, uh, potentially. And then Winsford, Swanley, Thornbury, and uh, Braintree. Brain. Th th that's a triple. That can already go there. We can have. Uh, Swanley, Winsford, Eastley, and then Eastley can connect to uh, Penrith, Sand Sandbach, 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 depending on how you want to say that, English or German, um, and then Stuttfold and Eastley, they could just have another a straight connection, so I kind of like that, and then this, honestly, yeah, this can just be a bus or another uh, light rail connection, I kind of like it, yes, that's what we're going to do today, so, um, the main goal will be to not impede ship traffic. That is important. Okay, stop moving around with your cursor and stuff and just make something happen. This is all passengers on this side. 
at some point I really wanted to care about the uh, noise pollution, but uh, sorry, not sorry, this is not going to happen. Where should we put the central station? I think pause right smack dab in the middle. Yeah, let's get rid of most of this passenger nonsense because we don't need that anyways. That should be fine. We even have a little bit of tra well, traffic, a little bit of thing on the right side of this so that can actually expand to that side as well. I don't hate that. That's that's really nice. And give me a building. We are still on the older buildings. That's fine. This will be what? Let's plan. So the 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 inner city has to be up and down. So two stations for that. Then I need a regional stop for the for, for this line. Then I may even put a just a short train that runs between Oddbury and Swanley. It just looks like they're really big. So we're now at four. Winsford will be five. And this is also going to be a terminal station. So five is what we need at least. And then we still need some way to actually run our I'll make this really long. Yeah, this is this is a this is a proper station. And we're gonna we, we'll be able to readjust it later on. And then we still need a way to run our um our main line through here. So we'll figure out how we do that. I think this is what I want to do because I need to expand from the correct location. And this this station, we're gonna expand a little bit so we can cheat with the catchment area and just get more more of this area connected as well. This station would actually work really, really nice if we add some um, some mods or something else to it. So this is what I wanna do. Middle will be our just main line, whatever, whatever goes through there should be fine. This is the high-speed rail. Ooh. Ooh, I I am I am thinking of something that I think will make this a lot easier. But that requires me to remove a lot of stuff that we already have here for free. And for some reason, we have the uh, electrified rail again. Thank you, Autosafe. That was very necessary right now. Um, but yeah, we're going to remove this. Um, I, I, th I think you will like what I'm coming up with. I think you will like what I'm coming up with. What is my plan? My plan is the outside station right here. It's just going to be a terminal station. Honestly, yeah, that's fine. The outside station is just going to be a terminus for um, this line that goes through Winsford and etc. Then in the set, then the next line, this is going to be a through line for any uh, cargo. And I'm actually going to do two through lines for cargo per direction. Then this one is going to be the um, high speed, high speed main line connection then give me some more track. This one is going to be the other direction of the high-speed main line, then two more single direction, um, just main, main line cargo trains going through there. And then <clears throat> we need our, um, what's it called? We need our connection, our, there, the Thornbury needs a, needs a terminal station on this side. So that's what we're gonna add here. And then it will look nice because now we can actually have this like this. I will split this platform in two. So we have a train going to um, Oldbury as well as to uh, just behind me. I should probably learn the names of those places, but that's not that important. Hold on. I'm going to just complete this really quick. Cool. And that's fine. What is my little emblem of doom doing here? Oh, you're just, you're just missing a connection. That's fine. We'll, we'll get that back for you. Don't worry. Now we have this, and there's more than enough just traffic capacity to move everything that we want to move. It's a, it's a very big station, but I would like to argue that that is totally appropriate in this case. Now, let's give me something on this side, just a proper large building. I would like a proper large building over here as well, but why not extend this thing just a little bit so we can get a tiny bit more, uh, a tiny bit more catchment area. That's that's really what I care about here. So we'll put that there at the end of the station. That's neat. And then give me a smaller building because this is a proper large station. Uh, and now catchment, once we actually, once we align this one a little better. Should I remove that? Yeah, sure, why not? Then give me a piece of road. This road looks nice. Get a nice relatively straight connection here that looks Good. And give me some curve to connect in there. I saw it. There you go. Very nice. Then give me another curve to either we go straight down here. I do not hate. I do not hate that. And then we just have one more going in there. That one can be straight though. 
Can we save that building? Yes, we can. Okay. And now I'm ex expecting our catchment to be most of the city, not everything once. I think once we get another road connection from he from here to here, I, I, I don't really want to remove those buildings so they can stay. <laughs> they can figure out because they will give me that road connection there eventually. And that looks fine. Um, on this side, just another piece of road, just run a parallel to here. They will figure out what to do with the road connections there in, in due time. I'm not terribly worried about that. So this should be good. That is our main station. Now, passenger should get priority for building the next thing. So let's see. If I do this really nice and long and actually flat, that's nice. We... <clears throat> The passenger station is the same width as a as a piece of track, if you didn't know that. The cargo station is exactly the width of two um, rail tracks or track track pieces, and that's that. So we could build a quick rail just thing here um, and see how that how that actually starts connecting. Because I do like the parallel stuff. I do like that a lot. I do like running passenger trains somewhat organized over there and then this one i can just try to remember it goes somewhere in this direction and this guy actually ends right here can i put a terminal there i don't i don't think i can and that's fine cool uh let's take this one back a notch and what do i want here this is the entrance to our to our passenger station really and shouldn't be anything else there's there's no re no reason to connect this to the other side however no nothing however it can slow down there it's fine yes no this is good so we're going to have to come no I, I don't like it i don't like it i this is not good enough where are we going with our track our track has to eventually hit this station and this station has to grow okay let's grow well, the station doesn't have to grow, but we need more track so we can actually get through the station with our high-speed trains. So that's something we can do right now. Let's get rid of a couple things here. Very nice. Give me two pieces of track. <clears throat> Very good. Um, this is the main line, and then that one just connects to whatever. Since we're already here, may as well, we may as well extend this station so that the trains that we're currently running into here have enough room. And that should also help us straighten out the pieces of track that we have there to uh, get a nice enough connection. <clears throat> yep, right there. Sure, a little longer because this is a bigger city. Um, there you go. There you go. Give me, how about you give me a passenger building right here that we can just connect to the end. That is very nice. Then I would not mind having this back on this side again very good miscellaneous may give me tentacles and that's all i care about and they can go there you can get technically correct by going into miscellaneous and saying oh you have to be able to go underneath here and then you go underneath there and people don't want to get wet when it rains this game sadly doesn't rain um but there you go we have a couple more thingamajigs that people can actually be happy about that's not bad now, this is obviously a little longer than what it was, and high-speed track is not going to like that. So now we're going to take everything back that I just said and remove the last edge um, of what we just built there, <laughs> because that was silly. Then we will place that over here. That's still fine. And now we're hoping that this... <clears throat> 106. Not ideal, but the only other way to fix this is, is by going the other way and... Well, this is supposed to be high-speed track. Um, we're going to fix that later. We're not going to fix it right now, so just get over it. Should I? No, I'm not going to put the passenger station in the middle of this. That, that's just silly. So put that one there. We get a quick crossover in here. We're going to replace our one signal that we had, and then we put another one right here, and then life should be fine. Cool. That is done. Next piece of business, or next order of business, or whatever you want to say there. Let's get this guy underneath. Yeah, it's not going to happen. <laughs> that's, no, that's just not going to happen. Let's pause this real quick. Let you figure out what you're trying to do. If I don't have to destroy you, I don't actually want to destroy you, but um, there you go. That's, that's what we're going to do. That's fine. And then here, can we do a quick wheelie? 
the wheelie with M, 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 M. Oh yeah, that's pretty. That's more like a hump. <laughs> that's not a wheelie, that's a hump. Um, let's try that one more time. I don't think we're gonna get anything better, um, but that's quite okay because we will be able... Yeah, is this better? It's just weird, weird bridges going on there. And that's just the way it is. I'm, I'm gonna figure something else out. It's not gonna happen right now, but let's let this move forward. So straight piece of track. Let's keep this as straight as possible with a with an aim to get to a new platform, to a new station. <clears throat> I don't know why I feel like I can just click and it will just follow me because that hasn't happened the whole episode. And we're a few minutes in now, so um, I should just get rid of that thing. <clears throat> I think this is a lot better than I expected. Why is that? Because we already have um, traffic that can go through there. We have bridges that are more appropriate here, and I don't have to raise the track anymore. The only thing I don't necessarily like is this tunnel in the back here. It's a long tunnel, and that's the only problem with this. I could go a little higher. This is not terribly high and actually feels really appropriate for the ships that have to go through here. So that is very neat. And it's a nice and gradual incline for everything that we're doing. I just, I don't like that tunnel. I think that tunnel is unnecessary. This looks prettier and that is the only reason I want to do it that way. 10 million bucks, no problem. Let's have a quick drink on that. Mm. Yeah, beautiful. Just, no, this works. I. These bridges aren't ridiculously tall, and they are supposed to be passenger high-speed rail. So that's exactly what we're doing, and I think it will be just fine. Are you? How are you not following the bridge that I have going on over here? I mean, seriously, why, why wouldn't you? Why wouldn't you just do what you're supposed to do? What, what do I pay you for? There you go. Put you there, and then run you along the side of this bridge. Um, try to use the same type. There you go. That's much better. And um, then this can just connect to the thing. Uh, by the thing, I mean the other side of this track. And I don't know if you can tell, but I'm really splitting them out very, very, very early. But my hope is, oh, that, that's pretty. That's just pretty. That is high-speed rail that has high-speed rail written all over it. This scares me a little bit because this building is not this big. <laughs> um, what do we have here? That is weird. No, that is weird. Why? No. No, 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 no. So it looks like you are starting to come apart here. Um, okay, let's take it back a notch from maybe here. Give me, give me the same point. Give me the same point to actually get started on. There you go, there's a little rope piece. And then we run this back because all I want here is for this whole business to actually be on the same level. Otherwise it just looks silly because the whole station is on the same level. Why would I want it to go um, not be the same? I, I don't understand. So this is what we're gonna fix. Then have you come from that side? Do -do 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 -do. Have you zoom out a little bit as well? It rolls a lot faster if you care, um, but it's not what we're doing right now. Hit that, hit this, good. I, I mean, obviously it had something to do with me clicking the um, M button once to go a little higher than what it was trying to do. Um, but this this is exactly what I would like you to do. Yes, yes, this is this is excellent. This is great. This looks awesome. And with that in mind, really, I, I'm a little worried that this has a, such a big plateau happening here um, because the, the, the industry is really far away from it. But we'll figure it out. It'll be okay. You, I think we're just going to run double track. We're not gonna run, uh, well, quad track because passenger is gonna run in the middle and all our cargo is gonna have to figure out how to run on the outside of this. And let's see, are you doing something funky? No, you're, you're snapped, you're snapped, you look right. Okay, that's good. And then this one has to connect to somewhere over here past the bridges. I have no idea what I'm doing yet with, with these bridges with the cargo because as you can see, there's no, no room. No room at all to go through the city that we have here, so it'll just be interesting. Or very interesting to see what we actually end up there, but let's just put this there so I don't forget. And connect everything up. That's really the only thing we can do right now. And then life should be okay.
Yes. Do we need the extra extra quad tr track thingies out here? I don't think we need them right now, but well, we could give it some extra space, but trains are really not set up so that they choose their own routes or their own adventures. So I guess we'll just leave it as this. Did you just open? No, I'm pretty sure you were there the whole time. <laughs> um, that's neat because the passenger train is the one that we care about. Okay. We already said that like 50 times today, but that's, that's okay. I'm hoping, ooh, I actually have to hope that this, this guy connects the way that I need you to connect. So stop doing that. This guy, could I run you on the outside? I probably could. I, I don't think that will even look super terrible, which is very, very interesting to me. Um, are we gonna run a train today? That I don't know. I, I, I do hope that we run a train. Collision. Yes, we could run. This, the extra train on the outside, but that's lame because there's nothing else we can run on the outside there. I don't think, yeah, I, I would have to turn on sandbox mode to actually be able to remove that guy, which is not what we're gonna do right now. So let's plan on the most outside track that I potentially use, which is this one, to get out here. Do we have other crossings to choose from? No, we do not. Okay. Okay, okay, what do we have here? I don't hate it. I don't hate it. It can only go 120, which is not terrible because cargo train's not gonna go any faster than that, so that should be fine. There may be a little tunnel here, a little cheeky tunnel. There we go, there's a cheeky tunnel, which is what we're gonna run the, um, the road over that is currently sitting right next to it, and that is neat. Now let's get this one over here. Cool. Get this one over here. Cool, and now here's the trick. Here's what you have to do. You have to put a piece of end track here where you want the train to or the track to end up and then connect to this. And then you have to judge yourself, does this look fine? And it looks better than I thought because usually these don't snap together very well. And then you say, no, this looks terrible because now it's just overcutting itself. So the piece of track that we want to connect to is probably going to be in the tunnel and not before the tunnel so we can have, no, <laughs> snap together, get it, get it together. This is the piece that we're gonna snap to, uh, to, this, to this piece of track that we have running here. As you can see, what I'm really trying to do is make long swooping curves that connect to the things that I would like them to connect to and look semi-pretty. Does this look semi-pretty? Um, here's the thing, a big tunnel looks always semi-pretty. There, there shouldn't be any question about that at all. You're not snapped. <laughs> Why? Why? There you go. Snap there. Go here. Yay! Track building is exciting. Very, very exciting. We're not even going to use half of the tracks that we're currently connecting. Well, two of the tracks that we're currently connecting, one of the ones that I just connected there, is one of those uh, candidates, but that is fine. Let's get a quick station in here because we have money. Am I, am I running? We are paused. That's not paused because I started the episode with 450 million. Yeah. Uh, and I thought I would have spent some by now, but apparently I did not. This one just gets a single relatively short station. It will need some public transport set up in here, but we will worry about that later. For right now, I'm just going to connect this as is, which means these guys don't belong here. And then I need a piece of track that runs straight from A to B. This one does not have to be super pretty. That is perfect. That is per no. That was perfect, but then there's a big tunnel in the middle. Do I want that? That, yeah. ooh, bridge? No, um, this is fine. This is totally fine. Only 1.6 million, sure, why not? Yeah, we, we will connect the 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 cities that are that, that have lost connection now later on it's just not it's not a problem that we need to solve right right this moment um here's what we're gonna do we're gonna connect cargo for right now to the outside stations because i i will need to figure out cargo how this works how this runs i just don't want to do that right this moment but if we do this um then eventually well this is not gonna quite get us to where we want to go that's fine um, where is that connection is right here and go in there. Cool. That should work. Um, we still need a way to get from here, which is the end track to that side there. First electric. 
I had a feeling. That's not a good one, but um, it will do nicely. Can I straighten this out here? My hope is yes. And by straightening out, I just mean get around this coal mine because that's what we really care about. Winsford, you are a lucky candidate and winner for where the main line is going to go through. And apparently you don't have a lot of traffic happening yet, which is cool. This, um, this road connection. Yeah, I don't know what to do with that yet. It looks like this is going to be our connection. Okay, what do we need? We really just need two simple... Here's what we need. We need three tracks. We really need four tracks. And we do need this to be a, a normal station. That's better. Um, line this up somewhat with this. Yes. Am I happy? Am I happy? Am I happy? I am happy. You're putting this right next to all the all the residential buildings, but I think we can we, we can get over that. Now here's what we're gonna do. I already know that my normal passenger tracks are on the left. So these will get a, just an up-down track, no problems asked. No problems caused. No issues, no issues were had. Let's go with that. And then um, the middle tracks are my passenger high-speed tracks, and the outside tracks are my cargo tracks. And then I will just add one more platform on the outside here to add another passenger building on that side. Hello, autosave. Um, right here, and then this piece of road is just ridiculous <laughs> because this, this mountain is in the way. <laughs> um, yeah, perfect. Right there is where we're going to put something. Right there is where we're going to put the other thing. And now I'm just going to flatten... Uh, I mean, waste some money. There we go. Wasting money now. Wasting money commenced. Looks perfect. How do we fix that? Well, the road is not completely flat, apparently, all, all, all around here, but we can get there. I don't hate this. The, the white rock actually adds a little bit of something, je ne sais quoi, as the, the French would say. And I, I don't hate it. We just have to make it universal, and then we can actually uh, appreciate it. There we go. That's better. I'm not sure. Oh, there we go. What is... Um, that that's a little weird that it's not actually flat there but okay whatever give me a piece of road again run it nice and straight right next to these guys keep it super flat and then there's no ugly ruffling on the outside so that looks good back to track building um outside track sure my outside track will be for the there you go will be for this one. It won't be for the other one, it's for this one. Obviously there's a piece of road in the way, I knew that before. So let's fix that. And, ooh. Yes, that's fine. I was, I was thinking out loud a little bit, and then I was quiet, and then I wasn't saying anything, but what I was thinking is the outside track that's currently for cargo, this one over here, right next to this guy, is, is that fine? Yeah, th this is supposed to be high speed. This is going to be a passenger rail that, that will just connect to that thing. And because it's pretty long, I probably don't need more double tracking than this. And if I do, I will figure it out from there. It'll be fine. Now you just connect into here. This is completely unnecessary at this point, but I want it anyways because I'm already here. Yeah, I'm already here. Oh, you're going to let me put another track right next to that? That is, you are too kind. That was completely unnecessary, but I will not, I will try not to complain because that's just lovely. So now my outside track is actually cargo and passenger rail, depending on what I want to do with this. And well, we'll just see what happens. But yes, more track. This is, does somebody care to tell me how much, how many kilometers of track I potentially laid in here? Um, just, just put a wild guess. Um, at work, we're using a new term or new to me, which is WAG. Wild arse guess. Just throw your wag at this. <laughs> How about you wag? Uh, yeah, so there we go, there we go. And this piece of track at this point, we're not gonna do anything with. Again, it's just cargo line right now, so may as well just put it on the cargo track and they can figure out how they're gonna move up and down anywhere. Cool, that is now connected. Wonderful. So that station has to connect to Eastleigh and we're going straight to Halesworth. Halesworth also needs to connect to Ashlam. A, hmm. A, Ailsham, Ailsham, maybe. 
hopefully. Who knows? Um, but they can connect there. We have Paris Sandbach uh, easily to health Hillsworth probably, and then Stotfold easily, um, Winsworth and Swanley. Only problem is Winsworth is so close to all of this that we, we may skip that one or we may not. I don't know yet, but this should be fine. I have a feeling this road is going to be um, in the way of something I want to do. I'm pretty sure that the that mine that's sitting in front of me, the quarry, is going to be in the way, but that's... Hey, why not? And yeah, this road is probably going to be in the way too, but that's fine. Let's put another ginormous... Just target... Uh, car ah! Wow, I I apologize. That was That was pretty bad. Um, let's put one more of these in here. This is it's going to be a large terminal for nice passenger trains, hopefully. Put that somewhat in the middle of this thing. It would be so cool if four platforms actually meant it puts a single platform on the outside on both sides, but it doesn't. So this is what we're going to do. This one's actually far enough from the uh, residential buildings over there, which is very nice. And there you go. We're just going to use the middle tracks as our mainline connection because I'm lazy. Yeah, let's go with that. And we'll see how this works. How do you snake through all of this? Wow, that's really long. This is this is definitely a super high speed track for later when we actually get the bullet trains and I can't wait for that. What's going on here? You go right underneath the thing or right above the thing. What do you prefer? I don't think I prefer any of them because this is a viaduct. Not an aqueduct, as many of you put on the episode where I used that word wrong, I think. Um, so that's clearly, this is clearly what's happening. No, no, we can't do that. No, that's that's wrong. That's that's ugly. That's, let's do something better. Let's get the ugly on. And I think what I want to do is kind of snake around the mountain here. This is what we're going to do. This, this is the piece of track that I would like to connect to. It doesn't have to be super long or anything. And then from there, it should be pretty simple to connect into the station. Just making sure that my assumption is correct. We are still a little high, uh, much higher than where I want it to be. That is, um, that wasn't in my calculation. <laughs> so let's try that again. Where are we here? We are at 18 meters. Wow, that's pretty high actually. And over here, we are at five meters. So something closer to that would probably be better. And that is, we have to get really close to the shoreline, which, okay. Let's put this here, make that piece a little shorter. That should be fine. And from there, you now hopefully will connect, but there should be a collision. No collision. There's a little piece of tunnel. There's a little piece of track happening. Let's turn these contour lines off so I can actually see something. Yes, so you get removed, that's cool. Then you get removed, that's cool. And that should be all that she wrote there. My goal is 100% to actually run a train on this today. Um, we will see if I can make good on that goal. Yeah, nice little slinky or swan neck or whatever you wanna call this is happening. That looks nice. And, ooh, tunnel. <laughs> And uh, the nice thing about this is making long rail pieces like this is actually super conductive for high-speed trains because that means the slope is generally pretty gradual if there's any slope. And that's what your trains want. Once they're up to speed, they don't want to slow down anymore. And if they're not up to speed, they want to speed up fast. And it's easiest to do uh, just that on relatively flat ground or relatively easy slope. So this, this, this feels nice. Now, the other side. Now we may actually get a better connection here right away, but hard to tell. Um, also, there's this, this is a sharp curve. Like what I really need is this. <laughs> and we're not going to get this. So let's take this back just a smidge and we'll see if we can curve around the mountain just a bit more than what we're already doing. Let's see. You, can you get... Yes, yes, that's not bad. What is our height there? Three meters. We don't need to go three meters. 12 meters or so is probably fine. Again, gradual is better. Um, this may not turn into a 300 kilometer an hour high speed track just because it is more curvy than I expected it to be. Mouse, where did you, 
how how did you lose your your track <laughs> that was weird um go over here go over there go right in there and now from here what connection do you think you can make let's just see a long tunnel a very long tunnel h all tunnel it's still all tunnel nothing has changed wait wait um contour lines turn you off this has to be a tunnel, most likely. I don't think we're gonna get around that. We got we moved the tunnel from all the way under here, which was a longer tunnel, to not all the way under there anymore. Clicking M once actually gives us something that is more acceptable. And this will be a tunnel anyways, unless I carve out some I carve out the mountain effectively. I don't hate it. I don't hate it. That's fine. High speed rail does have tunnels every once in a while, and we'll just have to deal with that. Okay, get you here, and we're really close. We're really close to running a high-speed train on this without any of the the things that we should have already set up to make passengers work, which is just public transport and those things. Um, yeah, that one's connected. So now we have Swanley on here. We have a nice little tunnel there. That is beautiful. Look at that. I I could have not come up with a better setup for that than than what you see right there. Is this the right size? Yes, that's the right size. I would like something a little curvy, curving into here, and then curving out of there. Beautiful, look at that. Ah, oh, just like, almost like it came from a mod. That's just, that's just good stuff. Is there anything here? Yeah, Winsford, you would like a connection to you. Sorry, you're not gonna take uh, the pretty route. You're gonna take the scenic route. There you go. There's a road, and now you should be happy too. Who else is complaining? Everyone, <laughs> everyone over here is complaining. Um, there was a road over there. Nobody cares about that. Winsford is now connected. That's fine. Eastley is kind of connected. Oh, this guy. Yeah. What are we doing here? What are we doing here? This is not important. This is not important at all. What are you doing? Here's what we're going to do. We're going to go as close as we can to the track, just in the middle of the track, and run out a piece of road that way and a piece of road this way. Doing it like this should ensure that our track does not get a lump. And that looked like it actually worked this time. So that's that's neat. Get this one connected to that piece of road. That is also neat. That should have reconnected a lot of them. Um, Hailsworth, Ain, Ashlam, Hainsworth. Where's Hainsworth? Hainsworth is there. Oh, really? This is your problem. Oh, come on. Now we have Oddbury Swan Swanley. Um, no, you're connected. You're connected, mister. No, you're not connected. This this thing over here is not connected. Okay, we could go over here. We, we will go over here. Uh, yes, give me dirt road. Yes, very good. Get this one taken back just a little bit. Get this one taken back also just a little bit. Piece of road connected in there. Uh, I don't know why I care so much about actually making these happy and even worse, making these roads somewhat representable, but that's okay. Uh, once put up or over length travel line is too big. Well, that, that sounds like a you problem. Oh, because you want to go that way. Mm, yeah, we'll figure that out later. And Swanley, Swanley Thornbury is right there. Um, for right now, how about you just jump into this road? Really? You don't count as connected because... Okay, we'll leave that alone. I don't care about that one. <clears throat> okay, next piece of business. We have an electric train that can go just 120. Is that... Well, I should have just let this run more. I should have let this run faster. Uh, we, we can adjust that. Let's go to four times speed just for a couple of days. And then we'll see what happens. What vehicles do we have available right now? Diesel, nothing electric. This one, it can only go 120. I would like 180 on this route. I don't know when exactly we're getting that, but um, there are a couple things we have to do. First thing, I have to start electrifying stuff. Uh, electrifying just means you click here uh, on this guy and then outside of the... Do I want to electrify out here? Let's see, where, where do we start? We're starting in Scrumptious. Scrumptious right now doesn't even have a an international or in a city inner city line that I could even connect to here. Uh, that's that's a that's a big fumble. 
Hey, our first airplane. Airp uh, airports are un unlocked. That's that's neat. But yes, didn't we just redo the Soul Station not too long ago? Yes, we did. Um, what I could do as a stopgap is use this station as is to receive receive the big inner city lines that I just created. There is, ooh, actually, I, I don't hate this. There is a lot of straight track just there that we could use, and I think I want to use that. So we're going to take this road somewhere else. Sorry, car. I'm just pushing you along. Very good. There you go. Uh, we're going to extend this uh, platform, and we're going to actually make it accessible from two directions because that should give us everything that we need. So put that there. Get me some... Oh, now we have the faster... Wait. Uh, no, these are just tracks with catenary. That, that's all these are. Nothing nothing else special. Get that one, that one, that one. This one has to go back a little further than what it is. Oh, we have the new, the new, pla the new, the new platforms. It's 1920, which means you got new platforms now. Very cool. Um, let's put that one there, 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 and there. And then this should be relatively simple. Just connect that track up to this side again, this track up to that side, and then the the inner city line that I'm going to set up here will have to be able to um, cross over on either side so they can use a platform that's free because right now multiple trains are using this, which is fine, which is totally fine, but we, we need just more. So now if, if we just want to, I, I, I feel like I just want to electrify this side of the whole business uh, because the other, no, wrong. The other side is going to concentrate more on diesels and similar things, and we are, I don't know, I'm, I'm, I just don't want to mix them if I don't have to, and I'd rather put another depot on the other side and do that. Yes, that's what we're going to do. Let's get all of this nice and connected, make everyone happy. Yeah. It's going to be a minute because I should have just electrified this when, when I built all of this, but I obviously didn't. Okay, we're well, almost done. At this point, I just have to signal a couple of things. And since this is supposed to be high-speed passenger, I just don't expect a lot of trains on here. So it's based these signals out really, really far. They should never have to stop it. On, uh, well, just in the very beginning. Uh, and that's really it. So spacing this out hopefully takes care of all of that. Let's see, do I know what the middle is? This is um, one, two, this is cargo. This is passenger. Okay, put one there, put one here. And then did we stop it? Yes, we are stopping there, very good. And give me another, just one or two signals here. I like making them a I'm making them one way because it's more appropriate, but it's totally fine not to do that most of the time, some of the time at least. Let's go get one here, and here is where the high-speed train will be slowed down just a little bit because of uh, other traffic that will occur in that general area. Okay, last thing that we need to do here is get a get a depot going. Hey, you, autosave, thank you. Let's get a depot going. Where should we put the depot? I think the depot can connect to this. Um, ooh, this is a great, great cargo train, but we're not ready for cargo right now. This is, that's fine. <laughs> um, where should we want this? I think I want to build this into the city somehow. So here's what we're going to do. Uh, give me a building. Give me this depot. Very good. Let's turn you around because you're looking the wrong way. Very nice. Um, sure, right here is fine. Can I destroy less of the big buildings? No. Mm, yes, sure. Put the, the lock shed, lock shed, locomotive shed right there. Very good. Ooh, oh, come on. That's just unfair. <laughs> that is so unfair. Now there is the extra high speed train that wasn't, that I thought I was trying to set up before, but um, now we're having it. That's a little rude. 
I guess I'll survive, but that that's just a little rude. Not not cool. Not cool at all. Let's let's level this out, make this look a little bit like something. I'll probably upgrade all of this track to the the super high speed track, but I'm not going to do that again right now because I just effectively did all of that. It's just silly. That's just to set up the line. New line. Yes, we are going to start here, and then we're clearly going to um, Swanley. And then from Swanley, we're just going to go to Scrumptious. Perfect. And then you go all the way back to Swanley again and just to the beginning, which is a perfect, perfect high speed track. I think Swanley is not quite in the middle, sadly, but it is what it is. This, this leg may just not make money. Station types don't match. What is a bus station? <clears throat> I really don't know. It must be Upper Scrumptious. I think this is the problem. Oh yeah, Upper Scrumptious is the wrong one. Okay, let's do that again. Click here, click there. Everyone's happy, Scrumptious. Um, connect them in a way that connects them. Oh, come on. You should have no problems getting into this. Why can you not connect all this stuff? Hailsworth, sure. Oh, I got the Alco, nice. Um, this is not helpful. What are you? Yes, this should be fine. You should be able to move wherever you want to go. <laughs> Getting more trucks. I want the faster, faster electric train. That's what I'm waiting for right now. Swanley, what is your problem? Swanley is two and four. That seems appropriate. We got nothing again. So that's fine. Swanley, you are connected here. So, okay, what we, I guess, need to look at is how are these connected? So if I go from Hillsworth to Swanley, why, why is there nothing happening here? Is this piece of track not connected? Nope. Um, that's not the problem. And you are also easily able to get back here. So let's, let's just do this. If I click on you, click on the first signal that we have going on here. I would expect you to actually be able to connect that, but I think what I'm seeing is a couple things. These tracks are not aligned. Oh, that's annoying. <laughs> that's, that is very annoying. Um, they're snap. They're not snapped. They're not snapped most of the way. Uh, and then yeah, this happens too. That's that's just very pretty. Let's try that again. Okay. Um, piece of track. Yes, you can be the faster one because I'll allow it now. There you go. There's a bus. I don't care about a bus. But how are you not connected to this? How How is that possible? It shouldn't matter that they're electrified or not because it's still all the same thing. So that is quite, 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 quite weird. Unless I put a signal in the wrong direction somewhere, which... Well, that would look different. So let's try this again. Take you out and then up to here, you can connect, you just don't give me the color. Okay, whatever. Then let's go to the next piece. Uh, can you connect to here? That is also pointing in the right direction and no complaints yet. Okay, can you connect to here? Yep, no problem at all, very good. And then we don't stop here, which is fine. And then I may have placed these on the wrong, wrong directions. <clears throat> Potentially, hard telling. Can you go here? No, you cannot make it to that station. So my guess is those signals, this, the, the first signal is actually standing on um, the wrong, the wrong track. Let's do that and this. Look at the lines, take this out, this out. This out and I would expect you to at least tell me that you can go from one side to another, but no. Um, Swanley, what track three? Yes, you can return from there. That is Sephir. Yes, Sephir is not a bad one. It looked like it had a new new skin as well, which is kind of neat. So, what is your problem? How can you not get out of here? That is just bizarre. Just bizarre. There can be a piece of track that can get you back onto onto the thing. That's fine. Um, but you can still not get out. I want you to get from here to Swanley. Can you, can you try? No. <laughs> uh, Swanley is two. 
Okay, now that track, that's fine. Then from Swanley, you can turn around. That is not a problem. That is not a problem at all because we can fix that in Scrumptious. Scrumptious, can you turn around now? Yes, it's happy. Okay. I'm guessing the signal that I had that was the one that was wrong. So um, we'll just blame it on that. And then just come back for Swanley and we're happy. Cool. 145. We got the Mallard. Volta file. That's a good short distance train that I don't mind. Um, the Hi Hiawatha. Hard to make money on, but maybe that's the one that we want. Let's slow this down because we've been running through a lot of vehicles that, that we haven't actually used yet. So that is that. Then over here, I want you to go to station one or two, because that's fine. Uh, because we have multiple trains running over there. That should be fine. New coach, 150. Okay, um, let's see what we can buy. There should be something appropriate for actual high speed traffic here. Let's go. Electric. Yes, the crocodile's pretty. The Milwaukee is beefy. Very beefy. We'll actually get up to 120 really, really fast. Um, but it doesn't have the high speed that I'm looking for. If we look at the steam, the Hiawatha goes 160 and almost has the same power. That's pretty cool. The Mallard is not that fast. So this one would actually work unless... Unless, of course, we go with multiple units for the Zephyr, which can go 177, which is by far the fastest until we can get something that... Um, yeah, no, we're going to go with this one. It's fine. Um, we're going to do a double Zephyr, though, because I do want some capacity, and we're going to get just two, two to start with. I think two is fine for 30 million, probably. Then put this one on line one. Line, well, oh, hold on. There we go. The new, new skin Zephyr. Really hard to look at with the, <laughs> with the, with the cable that I have sitting around it. But that's, that's a lot nicer. It was really shiny before in the older version, and now it's actually really cool. Would be, would be even cooler. Interesting. Does this one got randomized? No, the, the front is just more silver. Got it. Um, it would be cooler if I could actually turn this around, um, but I don't think that that is, that is a thing of possibilities at this point. So this is my actual inner city express. Um, speed, hump. Yep, that's what I'm going with. There's our train. We've done it. We've, we've made it. We are, cur no, no, not what I wanted. This is what I wanted, yes. Um, we've made what we wanted to do. Do we have... Yes, Inner City Express Speed Hump. Nice. <laughs> you can actually see it. I love it. Um, will this thing get up to speed? I don't know. Let's figure it out. Uh, but we're gonna go a little bit. Oh! Party foul. Okay, I will upgrade the tracks um, while, these, while these things get better then, and I'll be right back. And then I said my bye bye just in case you're wondering, I realized that this train wants to go 177 and my track was only on 120, so I had to upgrade that. But we have our speedy first train, which is awesome, this guy, the speed hump, and it's hopefully going to make us not go bankrupt. I don't think it will, but that's at least a start. And we have a lot of electricity set up now that I also have to play with. And uh, yeah, cargo is probably next because all the cities that we just connected have new cargo connections, which well, we have to get to. So, I hope we're going to get there. Um, thank you so much for watching. Really appreciate it. I hope you liked this one. And uh, from here on out, I know for a couple of weeks now, um, it's only been one episode a week. And yeah, we're just going to keep it on Saturdays. Hope that's okay with you guys. Uh, and we're going to keep the series going as long as you care to watch it. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you again next time. Bye-bye.